Australian police surround a cafe in the centre of Sydney, where a gunman is holding staff and customers hostage. Five people have managed to escape. Police say negotiators are in contact with the gunman. The motive of the gunman is unclear, but earlier a black flag with Arabic writing was placed on the cafe's window. The major priority is, to, is a safe resolution to this, where nobody, including the hostage taker, gets hurt. That is the uh, ideal solution. And one of the reasons that the, um, the, the, the police commissioner doesn't want um, to speculate too much is because, given what you reported earlier, it's very clear that the hostage taker is interested in media coverage. And uh, one of the major things that we want to do as hostage negotiators is control the flow of information in and out of the siege location. Um, so uh, if other people are calling in or if the media is complicating things, it could really uh, make it very difficult for the negotiators to do their job and to try to reach a safe outcome. We've been seeing some pictures there of some of the hostages who have been released. Um, presumably, they may be in a position to tell the police a few clues as to who the gunman is, what his demands are and what his state of mind is. That's right. But uh, you can't really uh, rely on that very much because it's unclear. Or, well, at least from my understanding, it's unclear how long they were held. So how long did they have to uh, gather any of this information? Um, we still don't know exactly the reasons why they were let go. Um, was it because they were ill or was it for some other reason? Uh, we don't know why they, uh, why they were chosen or whether they were able to escape in the chaos of the initial uh, uh, takeover.